Good day everyone, I am your aviator captain Austin. Today we'll be discussing about some intriguing facts about the aviation industry. Have you ever wondered, whenever passengers want to board a plane, they normally board from the left hand side instead of the right hand side. It dates back to the ancient sea navigation tradition thousands of years ago. In sea navigation, ships were steered from the right hand side only. This is called the starboard side. Why it then docks on the left hand side for loading and unloading? This is called the port side. Thousands of years later, when aviation came on board, this tradition of loading and unloading passengers from the left hand side then continued. Because of this, the pilot in command must sit on the left hand side so that he can accurately align the aircraft door with the boarding gate. This will now create enough space for other services like refueling of the aircraft and loading of the cargo to be carried out on the right hand side. Pilots and co-pilots are never served the same meal. Not because they prefer to eat different diets. This is done in the interest of safety. Just in case if something goes wrong with one of the mules, someone will be available to fly everyone safely. English is the only international language of flight. Hence, all the pilots, the cabin crew members, and the air traffic controllers must all know how to communicate in English language. Aircraft black buses are not actually black. They are bright orange in color to make it easy to find in the event of an air accident. Antonov 225 is the world's largest aircraft. It is powered by six mighty engines, nearly the size of a football pitch from nose to tail and from wingtip to wingtip. It is originally used to transport space shuttles but now used for cargo transportation. The world's largest commercial jetliner is Airbus 380. It's a double-decker aircraft with four mighty engines. It can carry over 530 passengers and its crew members. The air inside the plane is as dry as that of the Sahara Desert. To keep the plane clean, it has a good air filtering technology. The price paid for this cleanliness is to ensure that the pressurized aircraft has a low humidity, same as that of the Sahara Desert. This is the reason why the body easily gets so dehydrated when you are airborne. Hence, constantly drink enough water because the body loses as much as 1.5 liters of water every four hours. In conclusion, I hope you enjoyed these intriguing facts. See you next week for another interesting episode. I remain your aviator, Captain Austin. Subscribe to my YouTube channel, click the bell button for notification, share and like, and bye.